<laughs> Are you sure you don't want to call the hospital, see if you're pregnant? I will call tomorrow. Are you sure? Yes, I am sure, Jason. It's Valentine's Day. And you went to a lot of trouble putting all this together with a little bit of help. And I just want to fully appreciate every single detail. You want to dance? Why did you get so You haven't said much, are you okay? Yeah. I'm just thinking about how grateful I am to have you in my life and how this is the most perfect Valentine's Day. Well, I mean, it could be better if you would agree to maybe have a bubble bath with me. Settle for dinner? Okay. Just yeah, for now. Okay. No, no, I made it. What? What? Uh, it always surprises me when you cook. Uh, it always surprises me when you cook, too. Come on, <laughs> my cooking is not that bad. I tell well, you, it takes a lot of skill to make a BLT, and mm -hmm. just because I happen to run the toast and I'm gonna cook the bacon doesn't mean that I'm a bad cook. Well, I've never doubted your toast-burning talent. Okay. It's good. So you're not with me for my cooking. Why are you? Because I know what my life is like without you. And I want you in it. It's not, it's not because, I don't, it's not because I think that I'm pregnant, Jason. I'm not. I can't be. One way to know for sure? Jason, there is no way that I can be pregnant, and I'm fine with that, really. I love my life exactly the way it is. The only reason why I went to the hospital for a blood test was to prove Maxie wrong, because ever since she said it, I, it's like all I can think about. I didn't even have coffee today, just in case. And you know how much I like my coffee, and now I'm refusing wine. Seeing if it's on your mind, why not make the call? No, I don't need to. I am not pregnant. I don't want this to be the topic of conversation for tonight. So please, let's just try and forget about the test and enjoy this fabulous, wonderful meal that you made for us. Can you do me a favor and call the hospital? Jason, I'm fine. I don't need to know. I do. Hi, I had a message that my lab work was back. Yes, uh, Samantha McCall, a patient of Dr. Lee's. <laughs> yeah, a pregnancy test. Thank you. What'd they say? I'm not pregnant. Which is good, because it looks like I can have that glass of wine after all. You know, I should have probably bet money with Maxie, because it would have been a short thing. Are you, are you okay? Yes, of course I'm fine, Jason. Our lives are not set up for children. And it's the reason why you gave up Jake, to keep him safe, give him what Michael didn't have, a normal childhood away from the business. Yes, I know that's what I wanted. What do you want? I have all I need. Sam, you don't have to tell me what you think I, I want to hear. How do you feel? I don't even know why I'm crying.
saying I accepted the fact that I couldn't have kids a really long time ago. You're alive, you just don't want to have kids. Yeah, but I'm not set up to be a mom, and I know that. It's just that when I got lightheaded at Jake's and I felt sick to my stomach for a second, I thought about what it was like to be pregnant because that's what I know, and I thought that maybe, just maybe, I could get pregnant without any procedure or choices. Ugh. It's not that I'm surprised that it didn't happen. I am not. I'm just, I don't know, I guess I, I, I didn't expect to get this disappointed. If you want to look into that procedure. No, okay. Jason, no, I, I don't. I, I don't want to have to bother with fertility reconstruction and doctor's appointments when it's not even a guarantee that we can actually have kids. I mean, who needs the stress? Who needs the disappointment? You know what I really want? I want to enjoy this wonderful meal that you made for me. And have a really big cup of coffee with my dessert. It's not over yet. Ooh, time for a bubble bath? No. Oh. Not quite. I thought dinner was my present. We haven't had much time alone, you know, since Brenda moved in. And I just, I want you to know you were first in my life and that I love you. I know. Go ahead, open it. Did Molly help you with this? No. No. I picked it on myself. You did? Mm -hmm. Jason, I recognize the design. This is this is Polynesian. Just to remind you of Hawaii. You put my breath stone in it. You like it? Yes. Oh. Come here. I want to show you how Please much I me. like it. Oh. Get in there. <laughs> Hold on. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 